Hi, I'm Dr. James Devine with Eye Care Specialties, and I'd like to talk to you about why good vision health is important for children. Just like any other part of the body, we want your eyes to be healthy. You see, problems in the eyes can be causes or symptoms of other health issues, such as diabetes or hypertension. So good eye health is important for overall health. It's really simple. Children with good vision just have a better chance to learn. Think about it. Kids who can't see a whiteboard or have trouble seeing things right in front of them might withdraw and not participate in class or misunderstand. And most important, they miss out on the opportunity to learn and grow. The bottom line is that good vision means happy kids. Children are like sponges. They take everything in, and the better they understand something, the more confident and likely they are to participate. If vision problems are holding them back from understanding something, they can become confused and even depressed. Kids have enough challenges being kids. They don't need the struggles that come with bad vision. There are a number of things you can do to help a child maintain good vision and eye health. To start with, learn to look for these warning signs that a child may be experiencing vision problems. Complains frequently about headaches or tired eyes. Avoids activities that require near vision, such as reading or homework. Avoids activities that require distance vision, including participation in sports or play activities. Sits too close to the TV or holds a book too close to the face. Loses place or skips words while reading. Uses a finger to guide eyes while reading. Squints or tilts head to see better. Rubs eyes frequently. Closes one eye to read, watch TV, or see better. Writes uphill or downhill. And finds it difficult to copy material from the whiteboard. It's important to talk with teachers, daycare providers, and others who observe and interact with your child, asking them if they see any of these warning signs during their learning or play activities. And it's vital that you have ongoing conversations with your child, asking them simple questions like, are your eyes ever sore? Can you see things clearly up close? How about far away? Having that dialogue with your child is very important. One question we are asked a lot is, what age should I start having my child's eyesight checked? This may surprise you, but chances are your pediatrician began to examine your child's vision from day one. We do recommend that your child visit a doctor of optometry beginning at age three. Then schedule an exam before entering kindergarten, and at least once a year after that. But these appointments may be scheduled more frequently if your child is showing any signs of poor vision or eye problems. Your child's eye exam will be based on their age. Some of the things we routinely do in the exam include between the ages of one and three, screen for nearsightedness, farsightedness, astigmatism, amblyopia, or lazy eye. Check eye movements and alignment. Observe how eyes react to changes in light and darkness and general eye problems. Between ages of three and five, inspect how the eyes are developing. Examine vision using eye charts, pictures, letters. Conduct vision acuity tests. After age five, we check vision annually and screen for potential vision problems such as squinting, headaches, or difficult reading or writing. In addition to all of these things we check for, we also spend time talking with your child about what they can do to help ensure good vision health, like eating right and getting plenty of exercise. For more information on all these things we've covered today, just contact your doctor of optometry. I'm Dr. Devine. Thanks for watching.